Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we have another opening for you and it is a doozy. It's been requested quite a few times this one and I'm actually excited for this one. Um, it's Code Geist, called Ge Code Geese. I'm not entirely sure. I all I know is that there are five openings. Um, and it's quite a short series from my understanding from what I've been told, which, you know, all right. Um, but I'm definitely excited to see this because every I don't think I've found in any opening that I don't like. Literally every single opening I've enjoyed, which, you know, it's going to make it problematic when choosing another <laughs> video to watch, uh, another anime series to watch. Uh, so yeah, before we get into it, guys, drop a like to the video, subscribe to the channel for daily reactions. I am on Twitter, um, at Mercy and Wolf, if you want to follow me there. I do post on there when I'm going to upload the videos and stuff like that, just to keep yourself a bit more up to date. And of course, recently we passed the 300 subscriber mark. Thank you very much. And we are going very, 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 very well, um, you know, hurtling towards 400 subs. So thank you very much, guys. I really do appreciate this, this sport. You know, we're getting so many new guys every single day. And I just want to say thank you very, very much. I do appreciate it. It gives me that extra motivation. So... Let's get to the video, guys. All right, then. So this first image here looks like it's Japan. Um, so, th you know, that does tell me that we are on Earth, as someone pointed out to me. Anyway, let's go. Oh, a target. What's this? Like, this area looks like it's been destroyed. Oh, that's, that's, that's good music. Oh, this is cool. Like, through the, the optical nerve in the eye, and we're seeing, like... We're going to see it from his perspective, maybe. I like that. Did Ooh, yeah. we got lots of action. Like it. This These must be the protagonists. Okay. Ooh, that guy with the white hair looked bad. What's this? A ship? A dude? It's a dude? That's a guy? All right. And everybody coming in with all these gruff faces. Like, yeah, determined. Ooh, they look posh. They look like they're toffs. And they look like they're rebels. Ooh. Green hair. Never got that. Why, why that's so popular. Oh, what's this? They got mechs? Oh, well, that makes things interesting. It definitely changes it up a bit. Can she fly? They got all this technology and the guy's riding a horse. I don't get it. Handsome fella. Oh, man, that is a pretty sweet helmet. It, you know, it looked like that helmet adjusted to your face. That, 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 pretty, that looked pretty sweet, you know, and it's just a because from what I hear, helmets are, you know, army helmets are just not comfortable. I mean, I don't know, I'm not a soldier. Uh, but yeah, that was good. I enjoyed that. The music was very catchy. And it was uh, very good. And we got to meet all the different characters. Um, I I got an impression then that there that was like, there was like two sides. We got one side that was like a bunch of people and they all looked like toffs. They all look like snobby toffs. Sorry if you're a toff, you know. I do apologize. Um, and then the other side looked a bit more. I don't know. Um, what would the word be? Like um, modern, I suppose. No, modern's not the right word. Like I don't know. Like the the, the underclass, like the, the the peasants, I suppose. If we got toffs, then we would have the peasants. It, 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 it looked like two sides, and then all of a sudden, boom, out of nowhere, a mech appears. So, is mech the basis of this? Um, but it definitely looked interesting. It looked like it's set on our world, which is what someone told me, I believe. And it looked like there might be quite a bit of action. So, I'm definitely I'm definitely intrigued by it, for sure. Um, so, let's move on to number two. And what's with the green hair? Look at it. Oh, I like that logo. Gold is my favorite color because my football team. And oh, we got the optical thing again. Same animation that we had in the first one. Same picture again, but a different bit of music. Now this is like a repetition of the first one. I guess we're gonna have like similar parts in each one. Oh, okay. They look married, but then they look like they're in a chamber. Oh shit, that's a lot of mechs. And that's a sexy, a very sexy bad lady. They has to be a bad guy. They were wearing purple. They have to be bad. Oh, <laughs> I don't want to say she looks evil, but she looks evil. A key, ooh. Key looks important. Ooh. Wow. 
Yeah. So this is obviously technological based. Who are they fighting? Why are they fighting? Damn. Huh. Red hair, okay, yeah. Is she the bad guy? I don't know, who's this green girl? She keeps appearing. Is she like this the 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 guy the, the guiding light, I guess I suppose, for the good guys? Okay, and then we've got the same ending again here. Alright. Oh, I like that little look at the end when he takes the helmet off, I guess. Um, yeah, I enjoyed that. Again, that was really good. Um, not too long. Music was very catchy. Um, I don't know. Everybody who watches my videos, thank you very much, by the way, again, guys. You all know that I have this theory, right? In anime, right? It, it, and it's pretty much in anything that comes out of Japan, right? There's always a smoker. Always a smoker. And there's always a red-haired dude that's a bad guy. Now, we haven't seen a smoker, which I'm shocked by. And we haven't seen a red-haired dude. We haven't seen a red-haired girl. So maybe the, the red-haired villain in this one is a girl. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm really enjoying these openings. They're definitely getting me intrigued. Uh, especially considering someone has told me that it's only um, two seasons. Uh, which would mean it would be nice and short and brief to watch. So yeah, let's um, let's see. I like how as well they're also using um, the same sort of animations, but not like repeating them. If that makes sense, it's sort of putting them in, but not just putting them in for putting them in's sake. You know, they're actually integrating it into the new style for the next opening. Um, I want to see if the opening logo is different this time because we've had two different logos and the last one I really liked because gold gold is the color of my football team I am a Wolves fan you know, one of the reasons why I have adopted the name Mercy and Wolf I'm a Wolves fan in football or soccer whatever you call it uh, Wolverhampton Wanderers and um, most people tell you that it's orange it's not don't listen to them anyway I'm going off topic let's get to the third opening Ooh. Ah, oh, it's gold color again. Nice. I'm sold. It's gold. Oh, I like this slow reveal of his face with like little bits of information. And we got the optical nerve thing again. Ooh. It's a different kind of music. Hello. I haven't seen you. Well, I mean, we have seen it, but not in this style. It looks like there's quite a few good fights here. Right, she looks bad. You're telling me she's not bad. She's wearing purple. She looks evil. Okay, this must be our protagonist who's like a rebel or something. Ooh, red-haired lady. But she looks good. Oh, I like this. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, man, it's awesome. Oh, I like this. Oh, she looks scared. I like how we're going through this optical nerve and it's not really stopping and it, all the characters are popping up and then we're getting like a three-way shadow of them. That's pretty cool. Oh, and this guy looks pissed, man. Is that the same guy? I see he's like uh, in his civilian uniform and like his military uniform. Okay. Well, that, that opening was actually different um, than the first two. Uh, it took a different visualistic style as well. Um, we, you know, we just had the main focus on the, the iris. The, 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 you know, the, oh my God, I've said it like a million times and I forgot what it was. Um, like the eye cortex. You know, going through that, and then you've got the different characters, and I just loved the way it just separated them slowly from the one to the three shadows. I thought that was brilliant, and I love the logo in this. The logo, the gold logo, is brilliant. I don't know, um, because someone's told me it's based on like, uh, like a I don't know, like a hypothetical ultra other dimension on our Earth, and gold would signify money. Um, and power. So maybe that's why it's gold. Either way, it looks sexy. And I'm still disappointed in the fact that we haven't seen our smoking guy. And we haven't seen our red-haired villain. Uh, I've got a funny feeling they don't exist in this one. Which is, eh, it's a shame. But, you know, I can't be right about that all the time. Um, but, yeah, definitely enjoying the experience that we're going on here. And I am, I really do want to watch number four now. So let's go. Whoa. Ooh. Who is this green-haired girl, man? She's got to be... Well, obviously she's important. She keeps appearing. 
Okay, so Silver Hair Girl is not a villain. Clearly. Again. Bloody hell. Alright. She seemed to be like some sort of training academy here. And we got the gold logo again. Or is that yellow? Oh, no, yellow gold? Well, it looks gold to me. I'm going to say gold. So these things can fly as well. Wow. So, I mean, are they fighting each other? Oh, she looks angry. Okay, so this is like another faction here. Dude, I don't recommend ever walking slowly down a beach. It's just a nightmare, especially in that heat. I'm riding a horse again. Yeah. I love riding horses because I don't have a met my... Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, I'd get that panic in my face if I saw that that armada. Oh, I've got the eye quartet scene again. Oh, okay, I like that. And it's dragging in all of the characters as well. Oh, are they together? Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, we keep seeing that as well. That... Whoa, 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 what? Okay. So, I saw that guy in the first couple, you know, the one he was on, like, the, the, the flag mast of a ship or something. And he had that mask. I didn't realise it was actually the main character. Interesting. That's pretty cool. I don't... I hope I haven't just spoiled myself in, in noticing that. <laughs> I'm normally not this observant. Um, yeah, but I, I I like how they are all adopting this eye cortex scene, but they're using it different in each of the different openings. That's pretty cool. And the music again was quite catchy. Um, it seemed like everything was starting to come to a crescendo here, especially because we got the guy arriving on the horse, and then he, he sees his armada. He's like, uh oh, and then you see that it 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 um, splits off to his face, like shocked. <laughs> I liked that. That was good. Um, yeah, and again, the music, very good. And the, the, the main character in the green-haired girl, who I thought was like a guide of some sort. Are they together? Uh, they look like it. I don't know. Anyway, last one, number five. It's a shame, really, because I'm enjoying these. Ooh. Nice intro there, blue. Main character is the mask. I wonder if that's like um, a power that he possesses, he's earned, it's like a birthright of some sort. Oh, I like the different transitions between different characters there. And the different way of introducing our gold logo. Launch of the Rebellion. Ooh, so it's a Rebellion. Okay. And we got the, uh, uh, ooh, she looks sad. We got the, the effects that we saw a couple of the openings ago, which I like. So I wonder where these guys are based. I wonder if they're based in Japan. Or like America or somewhere like that. Well, that actually looked otherworldly. It looked alienate. And I wonder where they got the technology for these um, mechas. Because obviously there's no way we have mechas now. And we're 60, 70 years on from like the world war. Uh, I like this. We're getting, we're getting all the different characters. I guess because this is the final season. It wants to show us everybody that's involved in the series. Which is, which is a nice touch. I like that. I like it when series do that. He, that big dude with the white hair, he has to be the ultimate bad guy in this. Because we haven't, re we didn't really see him, um, but we kept getting flashes of him. Like, you know, like we, we saw flashes of him, constantly saw flashes of him. Um, just like appearing every now and then, like in each of the different openings. Um, I, so I, I've got to, get, I've got to assume that he's the main bad guy. Uh, like he's maybe like the king that's controlling everything. Uh, behind the scenes, or maybe not behind the scenes. Actually, he's probably not behind the scenes. He's probably the king. Maybe he's like a puppet king. And then there's some bad guys controlling him. You know, something like that. Uh, but regarding the music, I think the music for all five openings was very good. Very catchy. Um, I liked the visualistic style. I liked the corn, the corn, the corner thing that they had for all of the, the different openings. I liked that they stuck with that. I love the logo. The logo is brilliant. Um, and I like the way they introduced it a few different ways. And it is gold. I'm telling you it's gold. Don't tell me it's yellow. Because it's gold. And yeah. Um, I got the impression that they're fighting for a cause. With these mechs. Mechas. And you know. They're, they're losing. Um, until we see this guy. I think it was like the fourth opening. And we finally saw him. Revealed as the the guy with the mask that we showed in the first one. So maybe he gains that power and doesn't know about it or something along those lines. I don't know. Spitballing, speculating. What I will say is I thoroughly enjoyed that, guys. Thank you for recommending it to me. 
And as always, drop a comment down below uh, for anything you would like me to react to. I would appreciate that. Um, let me know what your thoughts. Um, am I close with my theories? Am I miles out of the way? Is it something worth a quick binge watch because it's only two seasons? Um, and also, guys, if you did enjoy the video, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel. We do have daily reactions. We do have daily openings or endings. Uh, we do currently have the JoJo series going on. We do currently have the Attack on Titan series going on. So, guys, check those out if you want to. Uh, I would thoroughly appreciate it. And, yeah, thank you.